So let's take a look at how you can create a React JS project with a simple HTML page. Now, if you go to official React homepage, then you will find that in Get Started, they have one sample HTML file that they recommend for playing with React JS code. Now, they do understand that running your production level code through such file would make your project go slow. So in such case, such type of HTML file based or CDN based React project is not a good idea. However, if you want to just test out your code, you can download this file on your desktop and then open in text editor. Okay, it will have three, five, uh, three references to CDN. Okay, so something like React development. Okay, here you will find React version. And finally, that development JS. Also, you will find that it has React DOM in development. Also, the version will be listed within that URL. Okay, also, you may find that it makes use of Babel file as well, just in case if they are adding anything new within the development javascript files and it will come with Babel as well okay so if you want to run react code what you can do here is you can simply create a script and for script here you have to mention the type let's say text and then Babel. okay this is so that it can take care of any such JavaScript from within your code that makes use of recent standards or it helps compiling your new React changes. Okay. Similarly, for running your first Hello World code, you need React DOM. Okay, so React DOM dot render. And within that method, what you can do is you can simply add your h1 code let's say devnami youtube react tutorial so this is my code that i want to appear in h1 tag and i'm going to tell my document to get element by id and here I'm going to mention a root as that ID. Okay, you can use semicolon or you can ignore it. With Babel, you can simply safely ignore this semicolon. No need for that. But I have just added it just in case some people may not use Babel, so they may need it. Next thing is you can also include your div ID that points to root. Okay, so that's it. Your basic Hello World tutorial with React.js example HTML file is ready. Okay, here we are making use of these CDN links for React and React DOM, so we don't have to set up on command line or you can say we don't have to set up them locally so we can directly get it rendered but do note that it is extremely slow to make use of such html file for production code or code that renders a lot of data so let me click on this file and it will take some time and here is output Okay, so you get the idea that if you want to make use of uh, this simple HTML file from their official getting started page, you can do so. And that can be a good option for learning React quickly. Also, you may need to install React Developer Tools so that it can show you this option with React editing on a React developer tool. So this React developer tool is available for both 
Chrome and Firefox as well. Okay, so this is for getting started purpose. So if you want to use it for small concepts and examples, then this can be a good starting point for your React.js projects.